Welcome back to Edgebeston in Birmingham for Cricket T20 in the Commonwealth Games 2022. A big match in Group A. India taking on Pakistan. It's always fascinating to watch these two teams together and how they lift their games when they come up against each other. It should be a fantastic encounter. Well, because we've had a little bit of a delay, unfortunately, we are going to lose some overs. Just four of them in total, two from each side. Pakistan then have won the toss and they've chosen to have a bat first. I'm pretty cool, couldn't remember the changes. Stacey Ann King is with me, I'm sure you remember the changes. Yes, as Magna comes in for Harleen Duel and bowling all wrong, the Snee Rana comes in for Rajaswari Gaikwad. Still no Pooja Vastraka, but they'll aim to score at least a repeat from that first game, 154 plus runs in this game. Change for Pakistan as well. It's a force change, uh, Stacey. Obviously, from Nida Dar's point of view, a little bit sad. She was brilliant in the last game, but she's out with concussion, sadly. <laughs> Expect movement from Takut. That's exactly what India wants. The plan has worked. A little flirt outside the off gets the edge. And unfortunately for Pakistan, this opening pair fails again. Just look at that. Beautiful. And that's what you want as a captain. You want your bowlers to bowl at their field. And the boundary. This is very good from Aniba Ali. Well, that's very short. But an almighty swing has allowed it to get enough back on it. Fired from Pakistan. It's a six. This is absolutely brilliant from Muniba. Up her second. Muni Bali goes for 32. Pakistan 51 for three. Four. Launched. It's hanging in the air though. Catching chance. And run out by the demeanor of leagues. That ball would have been circling in the sky. Great captaincy. Harman Pri bringing Taco back. It's quite low. Aisha the team has hit 6-6 six, six, and she was trying to go for a 7 but unfortunately didn't get a big enough piece and Monica Takor again is in with the wickets she does it at the power play, she does it later on in the innings Nassim, she goes for 10, Pakistan now 64 for 4 Vacant area, always runs there if you can get the placement off to be done Another run out chance. <laughs> Making no mistake that time, Jafali Verma. And she didn't have to rush. They're trying to put pressure on the Indian fielders. And then Radha Yadav, who operates around that region. My Mr. Hale goes for 10. Pakistan now 80 for 5. from Meghna Singh. Ali Riyadh's gone for 18, 96 for 6. Yeah, stick a 
Mafia. And the bag, she goes for naught. It's 97 for eight. Pushing and pushing to try and bolster their total here. But the innings are falling away rapidly. A good dive put in, but an excellent throw. Right next to the stumps for Radha Yadam to collect it comfortably. Pakistan lose their ninth wicket for 99. Finishing it off again, slow. Pakistan all out for 99. And his pace getting underway. Good delivery. It's a bit of movement off the pitch, it seems.
Pakistan, they have lost this game. Smitty Mandana just finishing it off in style. Got such a good swing. Very still at the crease. Minimizes her movements and capitalizes on her hand-eye coordination. Good signs for India for her. India as to who makes it through to the semi-final. So still all to play for with these teams. Pakistan though will be hoping for a Barbados victory later on tonight.